Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Flair, and I'm here to show you some cool things with Soul Sand. So, first of all, I'll just go over here, where there's this little patch of Soul Sand, and if you haven't already noticed, if you when you stand on Soul Sand, you kind of like sink down, opposed to standing on a regular block like grass. So, because it kind of like sinks you down, if you make just a, a house like this with the Soul Sand floor, and then when you walk into the house, you won't be able to walk back out. And I don't know if this is like a glitch or a bug or what it is, but it, it is kind of a neat thing for like trapping people or whatever. So it doesn't work if there's a soul sand block right here though. There has to be another block over it, otherwise you can just walk through. So like if I just put something there like cobblestone or whatever, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter what you put there. Then you can get in, but you can't get out. And this block has to be there too. If it's not, then you can just walk right, right back out. Um, another thing, if you have two blocks here, since you already get your head kind of glitched over top of this one when you're on the soul sand, there's no gap, you can just walk right through it like that. So the trap no longer works. Um, yeah, it's great for like faction servers where you can claim your land and then nobody can get out of your house. So, yeah, I'll just put the block back. Oh look, I'm just gonna grief all this good stuff here from this house. And then, I will be trapped. And I won't be able to get out. Of course, the trap doesn't work if you can just warp to spawn or whatever, but otherwise it's pretty good because then the person will never be able to get out as long as the land's claimed and they can't break out either. Alright, um, yeah, that's it for today.